On November 5, 2024, the Philippine National Economic and Development Authority NADA Board, chaired by President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr., approved a $439 million plan to acquire 40 fast patrol craft for the Philippine Coast Guard. This significant project, funded through official development assistance from France, aims to strengthen the country's maritime defense capabilities amid increasing confrontations with Chinese vessels in the South China Sea. The deal stipulates that 20 of the fast patrol craft will be built domestically. The new vessels will significantly improve the Philippine Coast Guard's ability to conduct search and rescue operations, environmental protection, maritime law enforcement, and disaster response. NADA Secretary Arsenio M. Balasekin emphasized that this acquisition supports the government's goal of enhancing maritime security, tackling illegal activities, and asserting sovereignty over contested waters. This move comes at a crucial time, as incidents involving Chinese Coast Guard and Chinese maritime militia vessels continue to challenge Philippine operations in the South China Sea. In August 2024, the BRP Teresa Magbanua, a newly commissioned vessel, was rammed by a China Coast Guard ship while monitoring activities at a Skoda Shoal. These types of aggressive actions, such as blocking maneuvers, water cannons and collisions, have been increasingly reported near Bajo de Masanlok and Ayunjan Shoal, causing damage to Philippine vessels and hindering routine patrols and resupply missions. The Philippine government is also backing the modernization of the Philippine Coast Guard through proposed legislation, such as the Philippine Coast Guard Modernization Act, introduced by Senator Bongo. This bill seeks to create a trust fund to finance the acquisition of new equipment, development of facilities, and training of personnel, all aimed at enhancing the Coast Guard's core mission areas maritime safety, law enforcement, and environmental protection. The partnership with France is also significant. French shipyards have a long history of supplying advanced patrol boats, and the new acquisition will build on this expertise. While it is still unclear if the new fast patrol craft will be of the same type as the FPB-72 boats previously supplied to the Philippines, the collaboration marks a strategic move to enhance the country's maritime defense in the face of growing regional tensions. This acquisition is a crucial step in modernizing the Philippine Coast Guard, with the goal of deploying at least two patrol boats per district across the country. It reflects the Philippine government's commitment to strengthening its maritime security and ensuring the protection of its territorial waters amid the ongoing challenges posed by Chinese vessels. With this new acquisition and continued modernization efforts, the Philippines is positioning itself to better safeguard its maritime interests and assert its sovereignty in the South China Sea. The enhanced capabilities of the Philippine Coast Guard will be vital in responding to the growing threats in the region, ensuring the country's security and the safety of its waters for years to come.